designed students as we all have received ebook of computer for class 5 so today i am going to explain chapter 1 computer system in this chapter we will discuss about computer strength and limitation of computer types of computer and application of computer so now to start from the word computer what is computer the word computer is derived from compute which means to calculate a computer is an electronic device that can perform millions of calculation or can execute millions of instruction in a second it can perform a variety of operations in accordance with a set of instruction called program we can also say a computer is an electronic device that can perform a variety of tasks by executing a given set of instruction in general terms a computer is a group of electronic device used to process data so this is the definition of computer the acronym for computer is common oriented machine particularly used for trade education and research a computer can be thought of a combination of hardware and software which transform some data into information The physical component of a computer that we can touch or feel is known as hardware. Set of instructions to tell the computer what to do is known as software. An organized dog facts and figures is called data. Information process or organized data form of data is called information. So let's. this the about strength of computer speed a computer works at an amazing speed without making any mistake a normal person would complete a specific task in a few hours whereas the same task is finished by a computer in fraction of the time accuracy computer performs its task with great accuracy it hardly commits mistakes reliability computer never gets bored and tired as we human do so computer is more reliable than human storage capacity a computer has large storage capacity it can store large amount of data in its memory the data can be retrieved whenever required versatility a computer can perform various types of tasks at the same time for example we can play games and this is music at the same time consistency the computer generates consistent results if provided the same input and processes reduction in paper work with the use of computer a large amount of paper waste can be prevented in any organization a computer stores data in the form of records that help in reducing a lot of paper work so these are the strength of computer now i am going to explain about limitation of computer no power to make decisions computer are unable to take decisions unable to take decision on their own instead they depend upon the input being provided by human no iq computer are machines that do not have self intelligence instead they need to be informed time to time regarding the task to be performed although with the advent of ai artificial intelligence computer now has the ability to take decision to some extent on their own still computer cannot fully think and decide like human do no feeling computer does not have emotion it for instance it can it it cannot be happy or sad no history computer are not able to learn from the past experience for example we make mistake and get get hurt so in the future we will be very careful on that situation but when a computer commit an error once then it would commit the same mistake again in similar situation So these are the strengths and limitations of computer.
now I am going to discuss about types of computer. Depending upon their accessibility, portability and user friendliness, computing devices can be classified into many categories. Let's now discuss some of the commonly used computing devices. Desktop computer. A desktop computer can be used independently of any other computer. It is primarily using an office or home. It is also known as personal computer. Handheld computer. A handheld computer designed to be used as personal organization organizer. Laptop. A laptop is a portable computer that is integrated with a display screen, keyboard, trackball, processor and a memory. The entire machinery of a laptop runs on a rechargeable battery. Tablet A tablet is a kind of microcomputer which offers a host of new features to the IT savvy world. With its electromagnetic screen, touch screen and software that recognize later returns on the screen. The pen acts as a mouse when moving over a tablet. Smartphone A smartphone is basically a mobile phone that provide additional features to perform day-to-day -day tasks. We can perform almost all tasks of a desktop computer with the help of a smartphone. After becoming familiar with different types of computer for individuals, let's now learn about computers available for organizations. Mainframe computer A mainframe computer is a large size computer that occupies a huge space. Mainframe are designed for multitasking and can be used by many users at the same time. Supercomputer A supercomputer consists of a large number of processors and occupies a huge amount of space. It can process trillions of operations per second. Calculation that a personal computer performs in 3 weeks can be performed by a supercomputer in only 1 minute. A supercomputer has a large number of CPUs and provides very fast and high level of computing. Workstation The processing of a workstation is similar to that of the personal computer. However, workstation has greater memory and more extensive mathematical ability. Embedded computer In various appliances such as television, washing machine, there is an embedded pre programmed computer that performs some specific tasks. Consider the example of an automated washing machine in which the process of washing clothes starts automatically and continues for a specified time period. So these are the different types of computer. These are the name of different types of computer. Now I am going to discuss about applications of computer. The invention of computer has led to the advancement in science and technology. Earlier, computer was mainly used by large organizations for scientific research and engineering applications. But today, computer are used in almost every field of our life. The major areas of computer application are as follows. Military Computer play as a vital role in the design and development of high-tech weapons for defense where accuracy accuracy is essential. Banks As a result of our computerization and networking of large number of banks, several facilities are being offered to customers, such as online banking, ATM, maintaining records of customer and their accounts. Research Computer facilitates work in every subject day by performing complex computation which sometimes seem impossible for humans such as launching satellites, earthquake, earthquake and tsunami warning, weather forecasting and etc. Education Virtual classroom e-learning online examination are the example of computer using education field. Media and Communication Computer have played a major role in revolutionizing the communication system. For example, Internet, Email, SNS, Chatting, etc. Criminal Identification Computer can create matching photographs of criminal by using description, 
This helps CBI staff to identify the criminals. The police also uses computers to track the information of stolen automobiles and mobile phones in order to catch the criminals in less time. So more example of the same uh, computer uses in signal identification are DNA fingerprinting, face recognition, blood sample collection for identification, etc. In the field of entertainment and animation and films. In the field of entertainment, computers are used for making animation and cartoon films, producing social special musical effects and bringing fantasy to use in music. Medical science. In the field of medical science, computer also used in different ways, such as ECG, EEG, CT scan, extra, X-ray, ultrasound, engineering, and manufacturing. In the field of engineering and manufacturing, architects and engineers take the aid of computer as a design and computer as an engineering for designing and manufacturing high quality products. Architects use computer for designing the layout of building and other civil engineering structures. Government sector Computer is used for official correspondence, budgeting, accounts, reporting, payroll, attendance, uploading of various schemes, and etc. Sectors like Census Bureau, Income Tax, Airlines, and Railway, Electricity Board, or Telephone Exchange have benefited greatly from the computer's technology. Publishing Business Computer has played a stellar role in the publishing industry. People now use word processor to write and edit documents. Printing of all kinds of books, posters, flyers, and even newspaper has been digitized. So that's all for today. Thank you.